can't see. It's so murky down there because of the mud. Okay, brainstorm. What am I gonna do now? I have a huge lobster pinned to the floor, but he's not dead. And if I pull this out, he's definitely gonna get away. I don't wanna watch the world go by. I wanna go outside and fly. So I'm just gonna say goodbye to my TV. This is just a little song I wrote. Gonna sell everything, gonna buy a boat. And I'm gonna sail all around this world with my family. Here we go. Previously on Sailing Nova Satis, we had big plans to leave at 6 a.m. for Chub Key with our buddies Alma and Hakuna, but when Philip was performing the pre-sale checklist the night before, he found water in two bilges. It was a huge disappointment that we wouldn't be leaving in the morning, but it was an even bigger blessing that we had checked and found that we had some issues with our boat. Water in there. Water in the bilge. This is on the port side, and then the starboard engine has a ton of water in it, which it never does. Do you see how much water is in there? For one bilge, and it's not even completely empty yet. It's probably maybe maybe another bucket in total in there, but it's just too shallow for the pump to get. You might have found the problem the The hoses, when they put the hoses, the belt that spins around, the alternator or whatever, the, ho the two hoses are resting on there, on the and it burned a hole right Okay, is there any way we can fix that? Not tonight. Just gonna ask. Multi-hour job. Okay. And I don't know where that water's going. These two hoses mm -hmm. are salt water it's cooling right mm -hmm. I don't know if you can see this but this is the belt it's right here this belt right here so this whole thing spins you know mm -hmm. and look. so that see how it's heating through it uh -huh. and look at this one yeah see that because they were resting on this thing so you're spinning mm -hmm. Those two hoses were resting, just getting the ground on. Brand new hoses? No, the hoses are old. Oh. But when they rerouted them, or whatever, they put the new engine in, they the hoses, they were down like this. This one was way down like that. And then this one was just super tight, just spinning on that thing. Why does it look like there's green paint on that hose? Because there is. No one left the next morning. We wanted to go together. So Julian helped Philip replace the old leaking hoses. Chew through the hose. And it was leaking water. See that? Uh huh. So. And then when they clamped them on so tight, it actually split the hose again. Oh, so Sun Power Diesel needs to know this. Should have replaced the hoses. Okay, and friends like Julian, may everyone have them in yeah. their lifetime. There it is, right there. Was that what was leaking? Maybe. I cool. hope this is what was leaking. But right now there's no water coming in. So that's, that's good news. But on this side, 
No. Um, the water hadn't come in anymore. So it's not coming in? No. So it might be just on a trip. Yeah. You know, the anchor locker drained there, maybe. Yeah. Rain. We took water over the yeah. over the hood. Um, rain. I just didn't check before he left. That was my mistake. So good. It's so hot. The screaming wings. Screaming wings. <laughs> I can't believe it. It's good. I mean, yes. I'm in. It's <laughs> so good. Uh, uh, how is it? It's super good. I love it. That's your father for sure. Yeah. He's coming. Oh. Look out. Oh. Dingy wreck. Let's have a race. Julian's gonna win. Big lobster. How big? Like two pounds. Your arm looks wet. Yeah, I, I went like in the water. So when you you're soaked. Yeah. Your pants are all wet. I don't care. Okay, so what happened? I missed him. So tell him what you're what you're fishing with. What, what the guy a give you? Paint roller rod with a extremely dull three prong spear tip on the end. And I need to sharpen it tomorrow because it can't even pierce lobsters. So if you get him, you gotta break him off and take his tail and put him in a zipper. Yeah. You wanna come with me? No. Okay. This headlamp is epic. I don't even need the spotlight. It's very epic.
three times bigger than any of the ones. That is enormous. Yep. It's huge. We gotta go kill him. We gotta go finish him off. Oh yeah. This is the biggest one I've ever seen. That's it. I think he's dead. Am I wrong? So that didn't work. <sighs> okay, again, like right here. Oh my God, is he dead? Okay, he looks like he's given up. Oh my God, he's not dead. Look how big. Oh my god. It won't die. I stabbed him in the head two times and he won't die. I stabbed him in the head two times and he won't die. With what? A knife. Can I get pictures, Mama? Yes. I know we made too much noise too. Mama screamed. I didn't scream. I just made gasps. I was gasping. I am super surprised that there would be a lobster this big in a marina. But there is. Bigger than any ones I've ever seen anywhere else. Okay. It's gonna take all your strength. So you can do it. <clears throat> so just... still alive, man. I'm sorry, dude. I'm so sorry, man. Oh, you're gonna knock. Are you gonna knock my plants over? Thanks, man. I don't know, man. This is hard. You keep re gripping. You don't have to do it all in one motion. Mm. 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 There it is. There it is. Go re grip. You can start kind of where you were. There you go. There it is. There it is right there. This is like a pound. That's awesome. Oh, I see his poo cord. Wait, can I just pull it out? There it is right there. Oh. Uh. God, that's hard to watch. She gotta get used to it, Mama. You think he's still alive? No, he's, he's long gone. That's just muscles. Okay. So, oh, will, will. explain what you're doing now. Okay, so deveining. I'm deveining, which is pretty much his poo. Okay. It's the intestine. It's intestine. So his butthole's right there. You break off one of his. Use different words, you're okay. Okay, sorry. Restart. Okay, hold on. Okay. Okay, so. What are you doing? Um, yeah, you break off one of his antenna. What, what are you doing? I am getting the poo out of the meat. Which is deveining. Which is deveining. Um, and his little anus is right here. <laughs> and I, it's really demoralizing and disgusting. But he's dead. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to stick this up his intestine mm -hmm. and pull out his intestine, which gets rid of all his poo. So you don't have to eat it. That's all his poo. Boom. Uh, it worked. Worked great. Join us next week where I promise you will not see that again.